Altera proudly presents our latest mid-range Agilex 5 FPGAs built on Intel 7 technology. The focus of this demonstration is the high-speed external memory interfaces that we offer on the Agilex 5 devices. The Agilex 5 FPGAs are offered in two series. The Agilex 5 FPGA D series are performance-optimized devices ideal for compute-intensive applications at the edge that require high memory bandwidth and small footprint. The Agilex 5 FPGA E series are designed for low density and low power applications that require high bandwidth memory. The Agilex 5 devices feature a hardened memory controller and PHY interface with built-in timing closure. With this advanced EMIF architecture, you save device logic and development costs so you can focus on your unique design. All Agilex 5 FPGAs include DDR4, LPDDR4, and LPDDR5 support. The Agilex 5 E Series Group A and D Series devices also support DDR5. For this demo, we will focus on the LPDDR4 interfaces on Bank 2A and DDR4 on Bank 2B on the Agilex 5 FPGA. Let's take a look into our engineering lab to see the results. Here we have a board set up with the Agilex 5 E Series Group B FPGA. For this demonstration, we will use the LPDDR4 design example generated by the Quartus software where the LPDDR4 interface runs at 933 MHz. As you can see, the device was successfully programmed with the bitstream from the example design for LPDDR4. Next, we run the signal tap analyzer to trigger on the rising edge of the status done signal and we run the test engine library tickle script to reset and run the traffic test. From here, you can see that the test has completed with no errors. In the signal tab analyzer, we can see that there are some AXI transactions. More importantly, the status done is 1 and the status error is 0, indicating that the traffic test has completed and there are no errors. Now we will use the DDR4 design example generated by the Cordis software where the DDR4 interface runs at 800 MHz. And then we will repeat the same test as the LPDDR4 interface. Again, you can see that the test has completed without any errors. That was a quick look of the Agilex 5 E-Series silicon with both the DDR4 and the LPDDR4 interfaces. To summarize the key takeaways from this demo, the new mid-range Agilex 5 FPGA family of devices are an improvement from our previous generations of mid-range devices, featuring high performance and efficiency, a breadth of memory options to support a wide range of applications, and faster time enclosure with a hardened memory controller and PHY. To learn more about the external memory interfaces on the Agilex 5 FPGAs, scan the QR code.